And we're back in the game with some more Rome Total War Hyper Big Hunt Eastward playing as Macedon. Where we're pushing towards our victory objectives. Okay, young lady, let's uh, click on you. Looks like we're six settlements away from victory. What are we going to do if we achieve victory? We're going to have a new campaign as somebody. And not necessarily in this same mod, although it will most likely be a Rome 1 mod. Uh, maybe a faction in this mod, or it may not. We'll just have to stay tuned to find out. Okay, looks like we're fairly stable over on our eastern front. Got a fair amount of ships. Gather up some forces. I think we should, because we should go and capture Salamis. I'm going to go and take those units. They're pretty happy like that. We'll, set, we'll go on down to Jerusalem, grab some more units, and get into our ships. Have any ships there? Nope, let's sail. Well, that is the port for Jerusalem. That one will be closer. Only a unit in each of those settlements. Only one unit up there. Right. You have uh, ships there. Yeah, we're retraining them. Let's go ahead and get rid of those rebels. Uh, didn't we have a new general? Yes, we did. Going to be claiming the Dacian capital this turn. Right, you're heading up here. You can start moving west of our armies. Right. The Britons have gone to war with us. Do not have another army down here. Doesn't look like it. I'm assuming that we're building everywhere. Though I could be wrong. Could have missed something at some point. Now we have 64 settlements to go through. That one? No. I don't like to miss any settlements where we could be doing something. Kind of looks like we've got everything constructing. So we do have an army there. Uh, that's a good army. Does need a bit of retrenchment. Let's do something about these Britons. Find out how tough they are. Because in my Carthaginian campaign, those Britons are rather tough. But this is, of course, on very hard, very hard. So the uh, AI factions are getting a bonus in battle. I believe it's uh, morale and melee attack, melee defense. Right, it's going to take us a while just to get all of our troops out. So you're on fire at will. Do up. Units, 
Storm Fart Will. Like we actually want. Spearman out front. Okay, they're gonna run. Where are they going to run to? Okay, our blisters are going to try firing. We may have some luck. It's really going to take a while just to get out. Oh, we have a nice little park. Yeah. With a pagan uh, standing stones. Don't we have our own temples? Sure, we must do. That looks like a temple over there. Maybe we need to convert this one. Okay, you actually got pretty close there. Alright, spell tests. There's some dead bodies over here. I don't know who they belong to. Let's get you out. So we can actually start shooting. Because the enemy does have a lot of slingers. Seriously, are you not within range? Just stop. That's because you're all spread out. Right, at least somebody's firing at you. Do we have any cavalry out yet? Let's move those balances over here. So if you start moving. Come on, you're within range. Stop. Got a very thick uh, defensive formation. Four, five, six ranks deep. Not sure, if we want you charging at the swordsman, so they shouldn't do that much damage. Yeah, the uh, ballistas are going to have trouble getting out. You in combat yet? Somebody is. Or new heavy pell tests. Let's get that cavalry in there. Do 
give the rest of our units a chance to uh, catch up. Right, whoever you ran into did not work out very well. Come on over here. Oh yeah, a lot of our pikemen are breaking, aren't they? Right, who have you run into? Alright, go after the uh, enemy Kev. See if you can clear those out. We didn't do very good against the enemy Kev, did we? What did we do against the enemy Cav? Your general's nerve is broken and he is oh, that's not good. We may lose our general there. Yeah. Yep, he's fallen. But we may still win. Nope, many of our units are now breaking. Still couldn't get these units out. Rather equal. 29. Nope, we've actually killed a lot of the enemy. Just have to kill more. Oh, great, now our units are starting to rout. Push. Uh, kill those British chariots. They're obviously causing a problem. Ah, still too much routing. Right, we need uh, some of those units to rally. Come on, rally. Nope, oh, breaking again. Go on, kill that cavalry. You not kill that cavalry? Nope, oh, now you've broken. We may lose this settlement. Who did we lose? Paramonus. Sad. Come on, rally those units.
Must be their slingers that are causing the casualties. Alright, have you move a little quicker? I mean, look, quite a few men left. Yeah, there's a lot of slingers there. They're going to retreat now. See if we can chase them. Ooh, we've even rallied some cavalry. Kind of looks like they're going to retreat. Let's go and try and shoot them in the back. Unit's broken. Shooting them. Don't let them rally. Yep, that's another unit broken. And victory is going to be ours. The enemy army is in flight. Their victory, but we did lose our general. So that's a bit sad. Okay, I'm going to have to punch there. We have 4,000 population. Should we get free cavalry now? Uh, yeah, we'll go for a heavy cav unit. Yeah, that took out 800 men. But it got rid of the Britons. Right, we just recently captured Santiago. Right, time to end the turn. Right, they didn't even try to sally out. Because all the way... There. If stalks the land, mainly killing the population of the garrison. Ready to sail. Right, you're under siege. Perhaps I should have had you move that way quicker. Right, what do you need? You're going to have enough cavalry. Because we don't even know what's in there. And it could be only three units. As it's showing. Could it be more. Right, you. You need to reorganize. 
Well, aren't we? We're going to give you some troops from over here. Any more retraining? Nope. There. Assistance is well. Yes, credible. Onward. Yes, credible. All right, head on up there. No more moves, sir. Want to be able to move out as quickly as possible. I think that's mainly an upgrade on those units. Okay, you are ready to move. March. Out of moves, sir. Uh, yeah, we can't even um, train all of our units there, can we? Pointing. Three new family members compared to our very large family. Two of this army. So those Britons have moved over towards the Bracti. Maybe they really want to claim that settlement. But we're going to be at full strength. Meet them. Do we use this army against the Britons or not? Or do we use it against the Romans? That's the question. Do we do anything interesting? Nope. Really? Now, where's our diplomat up here? Keeping an eye on the Romans. So this is their new capital, Atium. And their factioneer is there. Right, construction. We're just keeping these uh, settlements nice and happy. They're all still growing. And growing very fast. By you. You don't want to be very happy, do you, Masana? I want to be able to push out with a new army from here against those Seleucids. Let's 
try to improve your management if you don't have any. We move those troops down. Can in fact. It's good. So we can actually retrain them down here. What's this up here that needs retraining? Can't be. Uh, nothing really. Got a new general coming up here. I'm going to retrain you now. We need another unit in there. Got four cavalry, six marchers. Right, if we had a general down here, I'd start pushing into the lands of Egypt. Because they're usually quite wealthy. Alright, let's see if we get attacked. Anywhere. Aha, we are being attacked. Right, it's only 1600, we obviously outnumber them. Okay, not even sure if that's a city or a town, but we're going to be fighting that at the very start of the next episode. I can't even pronounce the name of that, but we'll be uh, seeing if we can win later on. Until then, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you later.